So we have fixed the issue. Um, what I ended up having to do was take the hard drive out, this one here, and put a new one in. Luckily I had one. Uh, pretty easy to do, so if you have to do that, uh, just search online. You'll be able to figure it out pretty easy. Yeah, just plugs in with like a piece that clips in there. But yeah, pretty easy. They'll, the one I had lying around was only 120 gigabytes, so uh, it'll be interesting to see how that goes. Um, but yeah, there's a, a few other settings people like you can search online, and it's just going into the BIOS and uh, like changing the way it starts with something, but that didn't work for me, so that's what's worked is changing the hard drive. You can get them pretty cheap online too, like 20 bucks for a new one. The other problem I had was with the Wi-Fi when I changed, when I installed the new Windows 10 on this laptop. Um, I had to install... Um, I had to install new drivers for the, the um, network adapter, I think it was called. But yeah, all fixed and uh, going good now, so... Cheers.